Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to a stream on Tramsim, starting in nine minutes' time. Mind the gap between the train and the platform. Mind the gap. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Please have your tickets ready for a ride on Vienna's, Vienna's tram network, starting in around about six minutes' time.
Passengers are reminded that smoking is prohibited at all stations and on all train services. This includes e-cigarettes. This is your final call. This stream will be starting in around about one minute's time. One minute time for the Dadrail Tram Sim stream. Please have your drinks and light refreshments ready. Good evening and welcome to something a little bit different. We are leaving the trains behind and jumping into Tramsim. Tramsim Vienna to be precise. I have said on numerous occasions that I would absolutely love to drive a tram and be a tram driver and now's my chance. So I've been keeping an eye on this game for some time now and it come up today in the Steam sale with 30% off. So I bought it. I actually bought a game instead of getting given one. Can you believe it? Um, Adam, sounds like a DJ at a wedding. Funnily enough, in a previous life, I used to be a wedding DJ. Just saying. Anyway, guys, great to have so many of you in tonight. 57 of you lovely people in for uh, a slightly different stream to usual. Who have we got? Phil Graham, Joshua Ritchie, Ritchie Ashley Smashley, Carlo, Pig and Bob, Laserjet. Great to have you here. Jason, thank you in the chat moderating there. Thanks for all your hard work, bud. And everybody else who I've missed. So... We are going to be having all the usual features, we're going to be playing locomotive location livery, we're going to be jumping in and out of the Discord server, and we are going to be doing our spot, oh no, we're going to be doing spot, drive or scrap. We're going to be doing that one, the new one. So before we jump in guys, and as always I've got to tell you, even though it's Transim, all the views and opinions in this stream are my own, may not reflect those many companies I may be employed by or associated with. I have played this game for, let's jump in. I have played this game for all of 15 minutes, so I kind of, 
I can get the tram to move and do things. Whether I can get it to stop or not is a completely different matter. Um, so, let's jump in. I don't know how long this stream's going to be today. It's not going to be a particularly long stream, I don't think. Um, we're going to timetable mode. Time settings, 12 o'clock. Distance of... Yeah, see, I've, I've got no idea what half of these options are, so... Let's just let's just press start and drive a train. Hey, Loco Class sixty six, how are we doing? Sussex Rail enthusiast, hello, Stu, JLS place. So excited for this. It's making noises. It's doing something. Let me know, guys, if you need the game volume up or down or uh, anything else. So back to game. Right. Okay. I'm sure quite a lot of you have probably played this already, so you're probably going to be sort of uh, telling me what I need to be doing, rather than the other way around. So I've got no DLCs on this, I've got no mods on this, I've got no nothing on this. It is purely just uh, as it comes out the box. So we are going from... I don't even know how to get the timetable up. Um, that's the kind of only timetable information we get. Cancel timetable. No, we don't want to do that. Okay, right. Let's let's just let's just go for a drive and see how we get on. Hey, Stu. Thanks very much, bud. That's very generous of you. No tea and biscuits with the manager. Um, I'll try my best. I'll try my best. Right. Okay. So, um, doors should be shut. Well, hey, it's moving. I've got no idea what the speed limit is or anything, guys. So we are we are purely winging it. So if you have played this before, then I am open to any advice and tips that you've got. Callum, where your local tram? Where's your local tram line? Mine's an hour away, and it's only one line, which would be very boring to drive. Callum, my local tram line would be Croydon Tramlink. Um, yeah. Rich are driving above the speed limit. So how do I know what the speed limit is, guys? Where does it tell me? I've got kind of no HUD or anything like that. So I've got absolutely no idea. I, I'm literally, like I say, completely winging this. So I am open to any um, advice that you may give me. We have a wheelchair user waiting to board. Luckily, I do know how to deal with this situation, hopefully. Fingers crossed. Okay, all stopped. Okay, one to open the doors. I struggled with this earlier on. Have I got to be inside to get the ramp down? There we go. Oh, okay. Yeah, I think the game might actually be a little bit glitchy. Okay, hopefully this is all going to work swimmingly well. Oh, if I can get back in the cab. There we go. Right. Doors. In the seat. Okay. Uh, free to close the doors. Sam Brooks, your root knowledge tells you about speed. Yeah, you're probably right, Sam. Got to lock it. Asriel, I played the simulator. Right, we are off. I've got no idea what the speed limit is along here. Um, is that a speed sign up there? 20, okay. That gives us something to go on at least. Bitte seien Sie achtsam. Andere brauchen Ihren Sitzplatz vielleicht notwendiger. It's all in German or Austrian or whatever language that is. Why can't I get it to like 20? Oh, I don't know. There we go. GJ Brown, I'm not affiliated. Plug, if you want to drive a real tram, and Seaton Tramway has tram driving experiences. Yeah, I, I definitely need to get on something like that. I would really, really like to have a go on a real tram. That would be pretty cool. 
Uh, Davidoff, how are we doing? Evening, Richard, my friend. How are you doing? There is a preview for the Class 700 next week. Excellent. Um, I've seen a few screenshots and stuff, and I, I think it looks... It does look really quite nice. I hope it drives well. I hope it drives well. Uh, crazy Place is German. Brilliant. Davidoff, that is incredibly generous of you. Five level three memberships. Thank you very much, Davidoff. Right, where are we stopping? Is it? Is this a stop? There we go. Okay, so one to open the doors. I believe the wheelchair user wants to get off here as well. I assume that means like excuse me or something. Um, no, no, no. Oh. Okay, that sort of worked. <laughs> People in Austria are very polite. The notifications are going mad. Thank you very much, Davidoff. Really generous for you, bud. Um, okay, so... <laughs> Hello to all the new members, whether you have joined yourselves or whether you have joined thanks to Davidoff. Lewis, welcome to Dad Round Membership. Great to have you here. Okay, come on. Right, we've got... I believe the A is basically telling me that... I believe the A is telling me when that comes up that we're going to be able to move soon. Come on, see if the doors are going to close. <laughs> Thanks very much, G. No, Mum Rail is uh, at work tonight. She's... Um, doing our NHS bit tonight. And he's broken your ramp, Jason said. Yeah, I saw that. Right, okay, we've got a proceed aspect or a, a keep going kind of aspect. Your first door is still open. Floor it. <laughs> we have a go aspect. Hey, 156 Andrew, how are we doing, bud? Formula 47 says LLL. Go on, then. Post your numbers now for locomotive livery location. Okay, guys, if this happens to be the first time you've seen one of my streams, then we're going to play a game called Locomotive Livery Location. All you need to do for now is post your numbers between 1 and 25 into the chat. And then we will play our first round. Right, doors are shut. We have got... Okay, so that's a distance signal with the cross there, I believe. So we can pass that. Uh, indicators. I'm indicating in everything that I'm being a good tram driver. And we've got to wait for the signal over there to come off to give us permission to go round the corner. Whilst we're waiting for that to happen, who have we got? A train spotted from Berkshire. You are the third number on my screen with 25. Let's play. Let's play. Locomotive livery location. Okay, guys, here's how this works. I'm going to give you box number 25. You've got 10 seconds to guess the locomotive livery and location of what we reveal. <laughs> Uh, not much to go on there. We've got some track and some ballast. Any faults, tell me what you think. Knöllgasse. Umsteigen zu 6. In Richtung Geier Eckstraße. 
So it was, I was tempted to do an SCR stream on Roblox tonight, and it was between SCR and Tramsim. And I opted for Tramsim, and I'm aware we haven't done Roblox for quite a long time, so we, we do definitely need to get back into that and do another stream on that at some point uh, in the not too distant future. So this is obviously Tramsim Vienna. You've got Tramsim... Stay there, pulling out on me. You've got Tramsim Munich as well. Um, from the reviews that I've heard, Munich is quite buggy, and this is kind of the better option of the two. Um, so be interested to hear your thoughts on that, whether it's worth me picking up Munich. Munich is the... Stop! Munich is the more expensive one as well. Um, but yeah, but like I said, I'd be interested to hear uh, your thoughts on that. We have people kissing in the middle of the road there. Brilliant. Um, Penguin's already guessing. GBR 66 at Penzance. <laughs> blob. There's inevitably going to be someone who guesses the train and location perfectly from that. There always is, Blob. There always is. Um, I don't have a signal here, so let's get going. Uh, crazy place. I prefer Munich because it has three full tram lines. Oh, fair enough, bud. Um, Sias, hi, Richard. Having a nice day? Yeah, not too bad. Sias, you've had your shout-out, bud. There we go. Vienna does look quite nice. Umsteigen zu 6, 18. I am quite impressed with the the level of kind of AI traffic that's going on, the, the, the people walking around. Um, yeah, that that's a lot more in depth than I thought it was going to be, and the the actual the graphics and the shops and um, everything do look really really nice. It's, it's it's a lot different to how I thought it was going to be. I pl I played a tram simulator many many years ago, and it literally didn't have anything going on. It was just kind of sort of nothingness. So this is quite nice. Uh, in space, I was working in that Roblox Railway game of mine, but I started slowing down on it in favour of my other games. They have greater chance of success and my passion is stronger for. Oh, fine. Uh, Callum, have you ever been to Austria? I've been to Innsbruck and my girlfriend taught me some German and they switched to English after I ordered a kebab on the phone. Uh, do you know what? I've been to Germany several times. Check out my videos on the channel. Um, Austria is definitely on my to-do list. Could be next year's uh, li next year's little jolly abroad. One five six Andrew, wish Edinburgh was on Tramsim. I th the two cities I would like to see on here are Lisbon. I think well Lisbon or Porto or both would be fantastic. Lisbon would be great with the Rome Ro Romero style San Francisco type trams, and of course. Croydon. Maybe in Sheffield Super Tram. Green light. Okay. Ring in the bell as we come around the corner. Kliebergasse. Umsteigen zu 18. In Richtung Schlachthausgasse. We've got a red. There's a car in front. Uh, Roy Mitchell Taylor, good evening from beautiful Derbyshire. Hope you are well. Yeah, not too bad. It's quite nice here. The sun is setting outside. It's uh, it's been quite a nice, pleasant day. Had a little bit of rain earlier on down here in the south, but not too bad. I mean, I don't think the AI people are up to much. To be fair, I think they're um. I think the ones on Train Sim World, the, the AIs are actually better on Train Sim World than they are in here. <laughs> That's saying something. Uh, crazy place. Yeah, I, I think 25 is okay. I, I don't know what the actual speed limit is on the route, but 25 seems to be okay. Hey, Nico Chan Cutie. Hee hee. Hello. How are you doing? Great to have you. Uh, have you driven a tram free Birmingham? I've never even been on the ba Birmingham tram network. Cheeky Fox, she's saying number 18 in the direction of Strassi. How was the pronunciation? Okay, I think that means we're going round to the left, maybe? I have no idea what all these signs mean. We are purely winging it. 
NPC suggest. Yeah, that would probably be a, a better thing to say, wouldn't it, than AIs? They're, de they're definitely not AIs. If that's the standard of AI in the world, then we've got nothing to worry about. Okay, it says 50 up there. Awesome. Okay, that accelerates. That's rapid. But try not to overshoot any stations and get tea and biscuits with the manager. That is pretty rapid. See, I think at the moment I'm trying to drive it like a train and I'm being a bit gentle on the controls. I think I need to be a lot more uh, aggressive and absolutely hammer the brakes in and, and skid around and, yeah, all of that sort of thing. Formula 47, uh, I just don't think for Dovetail this game is expansive enough. If Train Sim was a bit more like, if Tram Sim was a bit more like Train Sim World, then maybe it would do better with more than one route built in and more routes... And more routes and a better build. That's fair enough. So we've got the A just come up. Let's press number three. And we are off. And we're good for 50. So let's absolutely hammer it. Davidoff, you are far too generous gifting another five members there. I think we're going to have everybody in the chat's going to be a channel member soon. I keep an eye on these signals now because I am going to end up distant signals off. Okay, is that a station? Distant signals off. Break, 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 break. Davidoff, you made the notifications go absolutely mental. Sussex Rail Enthusiast, thank you very much, bud. Very generous. This reminds me of Omzi Bus Sim. Uh, I've not played Omzi. We, I mean, I mean, technically a bus isn't on rails, so maybe I can't get away with Omzi on the channel. But hey, we we did do Fortnite a little while ago, so <laughs> you never know. You never know. We we can do whatever we fancy. See this, I would absolutely love this. The screens on um, Train Sim World. If we had the DOO driver screens like this. Are you feeling okay, my friend? Everything okay? Do you want to share? No, I'd absolutely love to have the screens like that. That would be awesome. Oh, indicator. Now, if BMW made trams... Just saying, just saying. Uh, crazy place. Don't wonder when the track ends because we got rooted onto the wrong track. Oh, okay. Um, Jason, DOA driver screens in Tracy World will make it feel far too much like I was at work. Oh, okay, right. Um, yeah, this is probably not supposed to happen, is it? So what happens when we go off the end of the rails? Let's do it. It's a kamikaze mission. Nothing. <laughs> um, right, okay. Yeah, that's probably not supposed to happen, is it? <coughs> oh, excuse me. Um, should we have another go? So we have got... 
Uh, Davidoff, that is extremely generous of you, my friend. Keep working hard, Richard. You are doing great, and keep up the good work. And this, and this is interesting. But you will, but you will do get. You should do a points challenge on the Brighton Mainline PS5 versus PC. It's nice to have you back. When is the next SCR or WCR on Roblox? We will, we will probably do an SCR next week, Davidoff. Thank you very much, bud. That is really, really generous for you. Okay, so I think we've got a different train we can, a different tram we can play with. So we've got an E2 tram that we can play with. So let's have a little go. Let's change the route to U2Z. I've got no idea what the, all this stuff means. We'll just do it anyway. Let's try the different tram. Uh, there's two free trams if you want to try the other. You went through a stop signal earlier, did I? Oh, okay, right. <laughs> right, I've not I've not even loaded up this tram, so this is ancient. Wow, okay. Um I was gonna say hopefully the controls are the same, but doesn't look like they are. So I'm gonna remap my controls. Um whilst I'm doing that, let's play a game. Post your numbers now. For locomotive livery location. So I want accelerate to be A, neutral to be S, and then D accelerate to be D. Because that's how it is on Train Sim World, and that just makes my life a tiny bit easier. Um, okay, we'll we'll try and do this properly this time. We'll see if we can have a better time. Formula 47, do something more interesting. Oh, this is old school. This is a this is a proper old this is what I call a tram. Okay guys, what are we doing? Locomotive location delivery. Who have we got? Uh Ashley Smashley, I love that username. Box number five. Let's play. Locomotive livery location. Give me box number five, guys. Ten seconds. See if you can give me the locomotive livery and location. <laughs> Oh, that was an easy one. I reckon you can probably get, possibly get the loc. I mean, it, it could be one of two or three, I think, from that shot. Let me know what you're thinking. Right, let's go. Let's see if this works. Does this thing even have a speedo? I, I mean, it does all the way over there. Okay. I think the other thing, good thing you've got on this game, it does have VR support on it as well, which is pretty good. Uh, DT's gone GBRF something. Sussex Round Enthusiast says 69. Callum McCabe, 66 GBRF. Pig and Bob's gone 69. Sussex Round Enthusiast has gone 69, 006. Crazy Plays has gone 66. LW Rail, 69 at Tunbridge. GJ Barnard has gone 69 at Bristol. Um, Aldertiff Callan, sorry I'm saying your name wrong there. Bug Class 66, GBRF. We'll try not to go for any stop signals this time. See if we can, uh, we'll see if we can do a good job. Crazy place took me 10 hours to find the speedo on this tram. I'm guessing the door controls are going to be pretty much the same. Are we going to get a little stoppy marker come up? Yeah, there we go. Uh, the brakes are not as good, I'll tell you that much. Okay, so the door open button that I was using no longer works. It's really annoying that I've got to remap all the controls now. Um, so where are we? Open all, number pad one. That's what I pressed. Close all, number pad three. Let's try that and see if that's going to... There we go. Oh, 
all aboard. I like the fact the mirrors work. That's pretty cool. Oh, we've got a bell. We need a bell. Yeah, there's two different door buttons for this tram. One for the first coach, one for the rear coach. Oh, okay. So, right. I'm, I'm pressing lots of buttons. Nothing's happening. Right. Uh, crazy plays. I have pressed the closed door button. What is going on? What is going on? Okay. Um. <laughs> uh, wait, there's one for the first door and one for the others. Uh, check the key blind. Yeah, that's what I was just looking at. I've, I've pressed the right key. I'm sure I have. Uh, settings. Control. <coughs> it wouldn't be a dad rouse stream without something going drastically wrong. Um, close all number pad free, which I have pressed. And end door release, which is on the end key, which I have pressed. Illuminated push button door one. I... Is that the right... Am I even on the right train? I'm sure I am. Yeah, E2. Number pad 9. Let's give that a go. Oh, okay. Right, that seems to have done something. Right, have we got a signal? We haven't. Right, I don't know what I've done, but it worked. Okay. Eliza and her West French level crossings. I did get your Discord message, Eliza. Thank you very much for that. Um, we can certainly do LGV at some point. Um, possibly next week. We, we can definitely look at doing LGV. That wouldn't be an issue at all. Formula 47. Team Bick is for failing to shut the doors. Definitely tea and biscuits for that. It's got to be, isn't it? It's got to be. Schottenring. Umsteigen zu U2, U4, 31, 3A. Right, we, we, I've got no idea what the speed limit is, so let's just... Let's just go, bearing in mind there was a tram ahead of us. And hope for the best. Stopped at the signal. Stopped at the signal. <laughs> yeah, I... Uh... I don't know if I like this game or not, to be honest with you. It does look pretty good. Um, I am impressed with the textures and the graphics, and I mean, I am impressed with the density of the AI traffic as well. Not too bad at all. We got the A, which I think means get ready to go. Formula 47, can we have some see it, say it sorted? Just for you, my friend. If you see something that doesn't look right, report it to a member of staff or text the British Transport Police on 61016. See it, say it, sorted. 
Callum, I got tea and biscuits with the manager after I got into an argument with a Just Stop oil protester for throwing paint at the rear of the seats. That shouldn't have been that, that should have been tea and biscuits with the manager like, but shaking your hand and praising you and saying thank you, surely. Right, let's see if we can do the doors the right way around this time. So if I press Right, the doors appear okay. Things are happening. Things are happening. See it, say it, sort it. Yeah, sorry, Jason. I I've got another audio clip for you here as well, Jason. You might like this one. Um... You probably don't want to be hearing that when you're out and about, Jason. That, that would be a very bad day. <laughs> Carl Stevens reported to the BTP in Germany on a tram. Uh, well, Austria, but close enough. I'm, I'm, I'm sure the people of Austria wouldn't like me saying Austria is Germany, but it's close enough. <laughs> Right, okay, so we're waiting for the signal. Let's see if we can get this to work. Okay, we've got the A. I did a thing! It works! Sorry, Jason. End of railway emergency group call. Börse. Umsteigen zu D. In Richtung Nussdorf. 40A. Oh. Oh, no, that's a distant one, isn't it? I thought we were spadding again. Hey, I see a McDonald's. That was a bit of a stop. McDonald's! Oh yeah. My life is complete. We have in-game McDonald's. Actually, I'm quite hungry. I might order a kebab in a minute. Fat Richard. The stopping point right across the junction because that's really safe, isn't it? Let's just have passengers wait in the middle of the tracks. That's, yeah. Seems like a, a really place, you know. You could have the tram stop back here, but no, no, no. What's the fun in that? Put it in the middle of the track. So there will be a, another stream tomorrow night, guys. We're going to be in Train Sim Classic tomorrow night. Um, doing something on the Midland Main Line with 319s and HSTs. So that'll be 8.30 tomorrow night. So I do hope you can join me for that. Got the road all the way through. Oh, Mike. Yes, the double Big Mac. I believe they're doing a double Big Mac with bacon as well. 40, 41, 42. Debbie, do you want a double Big Mac with bacon? I need an excuse to go and get one. I love the rainbow coloured zebra crossing type thing, that's pretty cool. Post your numbers now for Locomotive Livery Location. Locomotive Livery Location. Let's have another go. Let's see if we can get the location. And the locomotive and the livery. Okay, we've got the road. We are off. Still got no, we haven't got the road. Stop. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 
Signal reverted to danger in front of me. Right, let's try again. LGBTQIA plus road crossing. Lovely stuff. Right, we are off. Rathausplatz, Burgtheater. Drive it like you stole it. <laughs> A category B spad, says Maxwell. Uh, Lyco Class 66, the... I've lost your comment now. The signals can work like traffic lights and they can go back on you. I'm fi finding that out the hard way. It's gone back on me again. I'm ignoring it. I didn't see it. Parliament. Umsteigen zu zwei. In Richtung Parliament. Dornbach. Hey, Jason. Thank you very much, bud. That's very much appreciated. Might as well contribute to the McDonald's fund. I saw that spad. No, you didn't. You didn't. There wasn't. There was no spad. <laughs> I did forget locomotive location livery, Eliza. You're quite right. Um, let's stop at this station. Again, stopping in the middle of the junction. That's interesting. Uh, right. Where are me numbers? Yeah. Thank you very much, Jason. Really appreciate that. Um, okay, third number on my screen is the Eliza. Actually, it was you and her West French level crossings. Number 13. Let's press the button. Let's play locomotive livery location. Give your box number 13, guys. 10 seconds, locomotive location and livery, please. <laughs> Mike Chaplin, these zero canted curves are making me nervous. Can you confirm the low? Motive from that. If you have got a little bit of railway knowledge, you may, which I should imagine most of you have, you may be able to get. You may be able to get. We're going to get across here before that signal changes. You may be able to get the location from that as well. Slow down! The brakes are actually really, really powerful. They're, they're, they're pretty good. I just need to get used to driving this style. Um, Callum McCabe, I've been learning German and all I know is... I'm, I'm going to attempt this. Dein Abdessen gunt in den Hund. Which means your dinner is going in the dog. You've tasted my wife's cooking then. She's not watching, she's at work. I'm safe, I can get away with saying that. A DET's gone class 69 at Red Hill. I like the brakes on this. Uh, Sussex Round Enthusiast has gone 69 Weed Killer. Ah, now you might be onto something there. If you've got any idea where the Weed Killer's been working recently, that might be a clue as to the location because it's quite a recent picture. Uh, DT, how long have I been married for? Ask my wife. <laughs> No, I've uh, married since 2017, but I've, I've been with my wife for 18 years. Uh, Nico, yeah, her... Um, 
I'm not saying your real name, because I don't like to say people's real names, but t tell me if I can address you by your real name or not. Um, or just your username. Uh, yeah, her cooking is alright. She's Portuguese, so she, she cooks nice food. I should be kind. Maxwell's gone GBR of 69 at all. Crazy place. Try the rain or snow next. Oh, there's an Audi. Car spotting. Day in with tears. Mercedes, Mercedes, Audi, Peugeot. Got the A. Come on, come on, come on, come on. We're off. Say it with a backwards S. Uh, SJA, is it better than Nando's? Oh, that would be telling. Yeah, no, it is. Tram ahead. But a scratch. What tram? I don't think that was supposed to happen. I'm pretty sure that wasn't supposed to happen. <laughs> I wouldn't cross in front of this one. Oh. SJA. Jammy Dodgers and L Grey confirmed. Is it English breakfast tea though? Are we going with that? If we're in Vienna. It's probably like pretzels and coffee or something, isn't it? I, d I, d I don't know what the sort of Austrian national dish is. Right, crazy place. You seem to know this route quite well. Do we want to go straight on or do we want to go to the right? I will let you tell me. And whilst I'm waiting for you to tell me what indication I need, I am going to ask you a question. Spot, drive or scrap. So this is the new feature that's still a bit of a work in progress. I'm going to show you three pictures and I want you to tell me which one you would spot, which one you would drive and which one you would scrap. Spot, drive or scrap. So we have the class 350 there, the class 68 or the... Trans Pennine Express Nova type thingy and all that sort of stuff. So let me know, guys, which one would you spot, drive, or scrap? It's all a bit of fun. Just let me know in the chat. Sussex Round Enthusiast, thank you very much. Are you a West Coast for Hours driver? Yeah, pretty much. Um... <laughs> Indication to the left says crazy play. So I think. So is that what we've got now? Are we good to go? That's so that's round to the right that that's got at the moment, isn't it? Which we definitely don't want to do. Right, what are we reckoning? I'm waiting for this signal to change. Lee Smith, lesson learned. If there's a tram in your way, ram it and it'll vanish. Ah, uh, Sam. Depends if it's a 350-2. Lol. DET, what are you saying? Drive the 350. Drive the 350. Spot the 68. Scrap the 800. Crazy. I would spot the IET. Drive the 68 and scrap the 350. Come on, train. Move. Right. Have I taken the wrong indication again? Why do I get the impression I've just gone the wrong way? 
Ähm. Oh, we might be alright. Formula 47, the 68 is just so ugly. The 68 is a beautiful machine. How can you say that? Liebe Fahrgäste, dieser Zug fährt nur bis Bösendorfer Straße, Karlsplatz. Yeah, no worries, DET. Thank you very much for joining us, bud. Phil Graham, drive the 68, scrap the Nova, and spot the 350. Success Rally Fuse, yes. Can we see the Discord? Of course we can. We haven't done any Discordy type things, have we? There we go, guys. We are in the live stream pictures page over on the Discord server. If you want to post anything over there, you can do. You will find an invitation link to our very friendly Discord community in the description below. And you're more than welcome to join us over there. Uh, the tram would now go back to where you came from. So this is the end of the line. Okay. So let's... If that's the end of the line, let's go back to the main menu. Let's have one more go on one of the other lines. Um, and we'll put some weather on and then we'll call it a night. Do, 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 do. Right, create a new game. I think I'm going to have to get some of the DLC for this. Because um, it, it is pretty good. We'll carry on playing on that E2 tram because that, that's quite nice. So we've just done the route U2Z. And we'll do the route 71. Let's make it... Let's make it winter at 16.30. And we'll put the weather as snow. Right, let's see how this looks. Richard's modern solution to the trolley problem. Take the wrong route. The trolley problem. Yeah, I remember that. Hey, Fabian, how are we doing? Oh, hello. It's a little bit snowy. It's a little bit snowy. The weather outside. Did anyone see Glastonbury? Elton John. Absolutely lovely. BBC, I like trains. You are in good company. They smell nice. That's about the cleanest comment you've made tonight that I can read out. Right, okay. We're on it. Doors are open. Ah, uh, that means I've got to try and find out how the windscreen wiper works and how the headlights work. Okay, that's... Possibly the cab light. Okay, this is interesting. Um, there we go. Oh, I love the wipers. They're pretty cool. <laughs> uh, um, RT, no, it wasn't quite that long, but get in there. <laughs> right, let's close the doors in anticipation. Uh, I live in a glass room. My local railway station was absolutely rammed full of people trying to get there. Ah, so I'm, I'm going to Glastonbury next year, hopefully. So, uh, probably going to drive down, if I'm being honest. Those wipers are doofy. Goofy. Yeah, they are. We're not stopping here, surely. I mean... Surely people can walk that far. We, you are joking me. Schottentor. Umsteigen zu U2. 37. Really? 38. Okay. 40. 41. 42. 43. Post your numbers now for locomotive livery location. Hey, Grape Juice, how are we doing? Ah, crazy place. This is the get off stop. The get on stop is over there. Ah, that makes sense. So crazy. What what indication? Which way am I going? Am I going to the right or to the left? Uh, 
Mike, heard it here first. Dad Row Glastonbury meet. I am definitely up for that. Oh, I don't think it matters because both signals have come off at the same time anyway. And both signals have gone back to danger at the same time. Crazy plays to the right. Looks like the points are set, so hopefully it's going to be okay. Right, what have we got? Locomotive location, livery. Third one on my screen is Pig and Bob with number 11. Let's play Locomotive Livery Location. Going to give you box number 11, guys. Hopefully it'll give you something on the location. Let's know what you're for, so. Oh, spot on. Anybody got any ideas what that might be location-wise? Let me know your thoughts in the chat, as always. Right, we're going. I'm not indicating again. <coughs> it is quite pretty, isn't it? I, the lighting looks really nice. Oh. That's a distance signal, that's okay. Um, Pig and Bob, 69003 at Tiverton Parkway. Yeah, Crazy Dash, you most definitely can hit the other vehicles in this. It just comes up, you have hit a vehicle though, and you just click like acknowledge and then carry on. So it's, it's not the end of the world. Uh, Davidoff. Dad, right? If you do the training on WCR on Roblox, you get to train. You get to train a pass the training for driving. Then you get to be a station manager. Oh, awesome! THB for no indicator. BMW driver. I'm I'm not a BMW driver. I have a clapped out old Ford S Max. That's a buzzkill. GBRF Class 69 on Platform 1. <laughs> I like your thinking. I like your thinking. Right, we got the road. Crazy place. You can also set the season to Christmas, and then I believe there'll be Christmas lights in the city. Oh, that is cool. That That is really cool. Hey, Maxwell. Romley Home Dimchurch Railway when it's coming. I've been saying that for ages, but we will do it. We will definitely do it at some point. We will definitely do that at some point. Finley Xbox 17, have you been to the Isle of Wight? I went to the Isle of Wight, oh, probably about 10 years ago now, if I'm being honest with you. Um, but that was the last time. I would like to get over there. Go and have a ride on the island line. Um, and definitely do the Isle of Wight Steam Railway. That that would be pretty cool to do. Right, let's go. We are off. We've got to stop. Parlament. Umsteigen zu 2. In Richtung Dornbach. So it would be good to have some kind of um, hub display so you actually sort of know what the speed limits are and where you're going. Um, it's nice that you've got to have that kind of route knowledge element to it, though. That That is pretty cool, but it would be nice to have... Um, Sort of for someone like me who's got absolutely no idea what I'm doing, purely winging it, that would be pretty cool. Yeah, Mike, I got to do the old stock when I was over there last time, so uh, 
bit of destock on the island line, why not? That's the diversity crossing again. Well, hey. Uh, Crazy Dash, the speedo is kind of hidden just over there, so. Yeah, why not? If you fancy doing it, then do it. Could do the Isle of Wight Festival instead of Glastonbury. What do you reckon, guys? Glastonbury or the Isle of Wight Festival? Or Rail Live. That would have been the better option. <coughs> Got the road. Let's go. That did not go back. Ring, Volkstheater. Umsteigen zu U3, 46, 49, 48A. Stop, start, stop, start. Maybe I don't want to be a tram driver. <laughs> Finley, Box 7, Finley Xbox 17. In Train World, will they add the Isle of Wight Steam Railway? I think the Isle of Wight Steam Railway would be a really nice one to do because we've got the island line, um, which it looks nice, but it's buggy. But it do, it's a nice one to do. Um, so, yeah, I, I, I think sort of doing... Isle of, Isle of Wight Steam Railway would be quite a, a logical one to do, to be honest with you. Uh, I can't see the signal from there. There we go. The A has come up. My doors are shut. And we're off. Uh, <laughs> now, somebody was asking me earlier if you could crash into the cars. There you go. You, you can crash into cars. Collision with car. That's, that's me no claims bonus gone. Yeah, crazy place. Blackpool trams would be a, a pretty good shout, especially like during the illuminations and stuff, and with all the heritage trams and bits and bobs. That 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 would be pretty cool, actually. I'd, I'd be up, to, I'd be down for that. Definitely be down Post for that. Post your numbers now for locomotive livery location. Yeah, Loco Class 66 occupational hazard as a tram driver, like you say. There's some really good um, tram. This is going to sound really, really dark. There's some really good tram crash videos on YouTube <laughs> of kind of drivers, drivers' cab footage where um, they hit cars and stuff where, where on sort of near misses, which is quite interesting. There was a tram crash recently where the driver is literally, literally sitting there on their mobile phone and they go straight into the back of another tram, um, which is quite shocking actually. But yeah, lo lots of good stuff on YouTube like that. Right, let's get across here before that changes on me. Okay, who are we going with for locomotive location? Livery, third number on my screen. Max, you have got the third number today. With number 16. Let's play locomotive livery location. Give me number 16, guys. Let me know your thoughts. What are you thinking? 
Yeah, I'm, I'm not too sure about the gameplay element on, on this, but the graphics are lovely. It's a, it's a really, really pretty looking game. The graphics are nice. Uh, Pig and Bob still going with 69003 at Tiverton Parkway. Crazy plays. There was a tram crash in my city like a month ago at like 7.30 in the morning where someone just hit the middle of the tram, causing it to jump off the tracks. Wow. Sussex Rail Enthusiast is 69 at West St. Leonard's. I don't, I don't think that's a real guess. Davidoff has gone Tiverton Parkway. Supposed to wait till we get that little A up, aren't we, before I close the doors, but my passengers are getting cold. That's my excuse, I'm sticking to it. Come on, come on. Everyone in this city is driving around in like Mercedes and Audi. I I'm quite impressed by the diversity of the vehicles, if I'm being honest. There there, there are quite a lot of sort of different vehicles and they, the vehicles look decent I like the way the road has got absolutely no snow on it though that's pretty cool tram in front Let's see if we can stop behind this one without actually hitting it. Oh. <laughs> Put the emergency brakes on and the track brakes kick in. That that is that is pretty harsh. That is really severe. Uh free is an outside camp. Ouch. 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 Am I not supposed to stop here? Uh, for some reason, it's not letting me open my doors. There we go. Welcome on board. Uh, no, okay. Um, right. They can stay out there in the cold then. Actually, no, I've got to open the door because I can't see the signal. <laughs> Hello, I'm the driver. Don't mind me ramming these trees and hitting these people. Yeah, it's all part of the fun. Just another day as a tram driver. So we've got 67 of you lovely people in. It's been a bit of a different sort of stream tonight. But if you have enjoyed yourself, then please do hit that like button. Consider subscribing. That would be absolutely brilliant. Oh, there's our stopping point. Okay, so we weren't supposed to stop back there. Just gone, just gone for the tab key to open the doors. Force of habit. Davidoff, do your announcements. We we. So let's have lights inside the tram. Um. It's gonna be one of these switches, isn't it? Uh, I think I've just I have no idea what I'm doing here Genuinely have no idea what I'm supposed to be doing We can do an announcement Davidoff It's got to be German style though isn't it Please stand, stand away from, from the edge, edge of, of the tram Yeah the tram is ready to go No I've, I've insulted, insulted the whole nation, nation of people, people now
my sincerest apologies. We are off. Okay. Am Heumarkt. Come on, come on, change. That sounded like Scottish and Russian. Mike, do the funny walk. Do the funny walk. That wasn't supposed to happen. Love it. 10 out of 10 German right there. Come on, if you if you have seen my videos where I go to Germany, you will know that my my sort of even attempting to speak German is atrocious. Those emergency brakes are really harsh. Sussex Rad enthusiast clipped. <laughs> no. <laughs> Uh, a bit like how my geography teacher gave out over 500 million warnings in 10 seconds. Hey, Rick Ashtray, never going to give you up. Good evening. Solid Hill Trains, what have I missed? Um, Quite a lot. Quite a lot. NJ Cure Me Dungeon, you'll never be invited back to Railfan in Germany again now. They didn't invite me last time. Right, we're off. This area of the simulator is so annoying because of all the AI traffic. Uh, yeah, laser jet. That, see, that's why when I go to Germany, I meet up with Alex, who is German. And then he does all the, all the speaking German and all that sort of stuff. It's always an absolute pleasure to meet up with Alex over in Germany because he's, well, obviously being a German train driver, he's, his knowledge of the railways over there, it's, it's great to kind of go there and, and speak to him and sort of get, get that insight into what goes on. It's really good. Angry German has entered the chat, says Maxwell. <laughs> don't, don't, don't! Oh, dear idea. Oh what are we doing? Am I waiting for a signal or am I just going? I think... Have I, got a, I don't think I've got a signal, have I? I think I am just literally going. Okay. Oh, we've got a signal up there. Right, got you. Offside signal! Signal is off. Mad tram driver coming through. Don't! Unteres Belvedere. And we have got a stop signal. And we've got a go signal. Oh, you know when I hit that other tram or the car, I, I've got the perfect sound effect for that. play it to you. When I hit that car, I should have played this one. 
You have caused confusion and delay, and terrible trouble to my trousers. Thank you, Max. Laser jet, laser jet, laser jet, just for you. Emotional damage! What can I say? <laughs> Formula 47, can you please fill in this quick survey as to how your tram experience was today? Please rate your driver on a scale of 1 to 10. You get those little bumper stickers, don't you? Like, how's my driving? I definitely need one of those. Crazy plays. Five more stops till it ends. No worries, crazy. And then that will be the end of tonight's stream, ladies and gentlemen. So, with that in mind... Post your numbers now for locomotive livery location. Yeah, crazy place. They're going to add a passenger mode. That would be pretty cool. Um, you could also add a mode where you could, you know, because the city's pretty well detailed. So even, even like a bus driving mode or a car driving mode would be pretty awesome. What's going on here then? Crazy Blaze, you have got it for locomotive location delivery with number 15. Are you going to give way to trams? No. Nope. This is going to be interesting, isn't it? We're going to have to bully our way out. No, no, you can stop. That's it. Yeah, I'm going. Hey. That was pretty cool. I like that. See if there's no passengers and no one, nobody's like done the request stop thing. Do we still have to stop? Let's play locomotive livery location. Crazy play is going to give you number fifteen, bud. <laughs> locomotive livery and location. Do let me know your thoughts. This will probably be the last round on this, and then we will have a little reveal. For the Let me know your thoughts, as always. Crazy Space, they have a car simulator as well, which plays in Munich, and the passenger mode has been announced. Anyways, are brilliant. Kleistgasse. I identify as a cyclist, therefore I don't have to stop at red lights. There you go. SJA, I think I'll buy the sim. It does look good. As someone who's been to Vienna twice, there's an authentic feel and design of the buildings. Yeah, it's on sale at the moment, SJA. I think I paid about £18 for this. It's normally about 30 Um... So, yeah, head over to the Steam store. It's currently part of the uh, the Steam summer sale. So, it's not bad. I, it's better than I was expecting it to be, if I'm being honest. It's been a bit of fun. It's something, you know, it's something different on the channel, which is always good to shake it up now and again. I just like ringing the bell. Yet to get a perfect stop though. Loco, a tram can go through a red light if the tram signal is off, but must stop at a green light if the tram signal is on. Okay. <laughs> Crazy place. I don't know how it is in other cities, but where I live, tram's got to stop even if no one wants to get on or off until 8pm where they can skip the tram stop. Oh, that's good to know. There must have been a signal here uh, that I now can't see, surely. Yeah, right ahead of me, look. Had teeth, it would have bit me. Formula 47. This stream is inclusive to all. 
Red lights, rainbow crossings, and bicycles. Absolutely. <laughs> Isn't that why all train drivers get into it? To blow the horn and ring the bell. Absolutely. Absolutely. Right, we got the A. Come on, come on. Let's do this. Got the proceed. Let's go. Yeah, GJ, to be fair, cyclists get a bad rap. Well, you know, and it's not all of them. There are plenty of good cyclists out there that do respect the rules. And it only takes like one or two, doesn't it, not respecting the rules and it ruins it for everybody else, you know. Because you've got a handful of cyclists that, that don't stop at red lights, automatically cyclists don't stop at red lights, you know. And it's, uh, it's a little bit of a shame. We're doing well. I seem to be getting better at this. See, we're lucky because someone's going to know the number. The Class 66, the Northern... No, the Evening Star. Is it the Evening Star? Yeah, the Evening Star. Has a bell on it. And if you go in the MCB cupboard, the cupboard with all the circuit breakers in it, you can trip the bell in and the bell rings. So I, I get to drive a train and play with bells at the same time. Race the car, show them who's boss. There isn't any cars. That's because they're on the right hand side of the road because we're in Europe. <laughs> hey, in space has completed their maths homework. Well done, in space. Maths homework completed. Definitely get a round of applause for that. 74A S-Bahn. We are at the goal. Auf Wiedersehen. This is the going home tram, can you tell? Train drivers and tram drivers drive faster when they're going home. Check my mirror now, make sure we don't get cut up by a car. Oh, come on, out the way. It's a backward say at. <laughs> yeah, crazy place you will have at some point have some car driver driving across the tram tracks. Come on, come on. The AI car just literally disappeared.
Oh, stop. Oh, stop. Emotional damage. <laughs> GJ Barnard, if I had, I, I need to get back on the soundboard and get like a, you know, a one of those kind of sound effects. You know the one I mean. Because this is quality. This sets the level of the, this is the kind of the level we're aiming for on Dad Rao streams. This is 100% the, the level we're aiming for. Why do cows have bells? Because their horns don't work. That, that is the level that we are aiming to achieve on these streams. Dad row and dad jokes. Why did the dinosaur cross the road? Because chickens hadn't been invented. Oh no, don't start. Right, check the mirrors. <laughs> Lorry air brakes. Yeah, I... I get it. Max, umsteigen zu 18, 74A, S-Bahn. Rimshot. That's what I shall Google. I shall go on to Tuna after this stream and Google. Go on to Tuna and search for a rimshot sound effect. Oh! I wasn't expecting that. I wasn't indicating or anything. Why did the chicken go to the gym? To work on its pecs! Hi, the guy. Hello, welcome to the stream. Mike, be careful what you Google. I do quite like the fact that the cars do kind of come onto the track and interact with it a little bit and cut you up. It, it does make it a lot more realistic. <laughs> Mike, rim shot could be troublesome. <laughs> I have no idea what you're talking about, Mike. Formula 47, Dad Row, Dad Joke stream coming up. The, the birthday special Dad Joke stream. Crazy Dash, I would like to see the manager. Too busy making tea. It's, it's, gone, it's gone out to buy more biscuits. <laughs> We've run out. I think this might be where we terminate now. Bitte seien Sie achtsam. Andere brauchen Ihren Sitzplatz vielleicht notwendiger. And we are stopped. We're still indicating as well. And according to Crazy Plays, I'm glad, glad you're here, Crazy. That is where this tram terminates. Let's play Locomotive Livery Location. Okie dokie guys, LaserJet, thank you very, very much for sending me this one. Um, I did mention it in the last stream, but if you want to play Locomotive Location Livery, we do have it in short form video over on the Dad Rao YouTube channel. So Dad Rao YouTube Shorts, there are some Locomotive Location Livery challenges for you to have a look at over there. Anyway guys. It's time to reveal today's Locomotive Livery Location. That is, of course, a Class 69. Two Class 69s, indeed, with the weed sprayer train, um, which has been down in Devon and Cornwall over the last few weeks, uh, working down there. It's back at Tunbridge at the moment. I saw it today. But it has been working down in Devon and Cornwall, which means that that station, as a couple of people did mention, is indeed 
at Tiverton Parkway. Well done to everybody who got that right. Absolutely brilliant. So guys, that is the end of the stream. A little bit different. I mean, it's on, it, it, it's dad rail. It's not dad train. And a tram runs on rails. So we get away with it. It works. It's within the scope of the channel. Thank you very, very much to um, Jason Davidoff, Sussex Rail Enthusiast, uh, and everybody else who has um, super chatted me today. That is absolutely brilliant. Thank you very much for your generosity. I uh, really appreciate that. Stu as well, just checking down my list, make sure I haven't missed anyone out. Uh, welcome to all of our new subscribers as well. Great to have you here on the Dad Rail YouTube channel. If you want more trains, trams, aviation, general chit chatter, then head over to our very friendly Discord server. You'll find a link to that in the description below. I am going to be live tomorrow, same time, 8.30, and we're going to be doing a run on Train Sim Classic on the Midland Main Line. I think the plan is going to be we take an HST from... Um, St Pancras up to Bedford and then a 319 back um, and that's going to be a custom made scenario that Northern Princess Productions um, is very kindly putting together for me today so guys yeah like I say if you haven't already please do hit that like button consider subscribing that would be awesome let me know in the comments section below if you would like me to do uh, um, Munich Trams in Munich um, yeah it is Munich isn't it Trams in Munich or maybe another go on this one at some time in the future let me know in the comment section below that would be absolutely brilliant we're going to press that button there for the out of date end screen which starts the music thank you very very much for watching guys and I hope to see you in the next one thanks for watching